Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Welcome friends and uh, this is our first drill of our series so let's start with it first of all we are going to open up our Excel after opening Excel uh, my mine is 2013th version you, yours can be 2010th 2007th any one of these three I think I'm not familiar with the past ones because I'm I wasn't even able to use my computer that days so I don't know those versions okay sorry okay now uh, first of all I'm gonna select some cells in here and merge them up and rename it um, main cell okay center cell okay its name is center cell and uh, as you can see there is a tab in which you probably don't have if you haven't had uh, experience in visual basic or VBA in Excel so you don't have that developer tab basically I'll show you how to get it so first of all go into any where in the ribbon right click on it click on customize ribbon and this one will be unchecked just go in here check this up and there you have developers tab now in the developers tab what we need is the visual basic what click on visual basic or you can uh, alt f11 use alt f11 key to open up your visual basic so we are good until this yes so before opening anything up I'll just uh, do some customization on my center cell and I'll just increase uh, it's width. Uh, yeah, this one is good. And I'll just choose Algerian and good. Center it up. Anything else? No. Again, Alt F11. And uh, I'm going to insert some module. Module is just a place where we put our code. We can put it in the sheets, uh, sheets too, but I'll just put it in the module for now because I'll just show you how to uh, create a macro. And if this is a uh, module is used to probably most of time you people use to create macro on it okay so I'm gonna say sub uh, hello world and press enter or I can, I can put, uh, put parentheses and then press enter I'll just press enter because I like it this way after that uh, I'll keep some space of course and I'll say that do something there is uh, some r uh, range range okay which is called center cell go there and uh, instead of uh, blank put hello world in it okay and this you're done so uh, to run this thing and there are a couple of ways to run it line by line so just directly run it or um, I think I know these methods these two methods so to directly run it you press F5 or click in the play button here the run button I'll say but it's like a um, video playing or audio playing button uh, and uh, just or you can say click in here and F8 and step into F8 is the one so click in here click somewhere in here and press F8 nothing will happen it will check the line that it's correct correct this one is correct if it's correct it will not say anything because it's just reached here it didn't check it now it will go in here as you can see it checked and it says range which is cell center is hello world okay as you can see it's great so we are done with this this was just introduction um, story which shows you how can you do things with code in the second tutorial I will just practically show you what is range what is cell and stuff like that as you can see what do I mean by saying cell uh, range as you can see as you can see it's cell cell and there is some code uh, there is cells 
and as you can see its row uh, index and column index I will be doing these two again uh, after this tutorial so thank you very much guys for watching if you need any help any help please don't hesitate because inshallah I'll try, uh, try my best to help you and shabakhar means tada yeah it means that